Ab has also a Twitter. It would be the gaming lab underscore, uh, as well as bros underscore calamity for the uh, actual stream event. And I'm going to stop talking about that for right now as we hop into the match. SSB Matt versus Blue. This is a very, this is going to be a good one, folks. So definitely strap in for this one. All right. Good job there taking it away. <laughs> <laughs> a little winded, but, you know, you got to handle that sometimes. Mm -hmm. And now we got Matt versus Blue. Mm -hmm. I remember Matt telling me earlier how he was very afraid for this, for this fight right here. I know, yeah. Blue Blue's Charizard is one of the best I've seen in a long while. But I mean, uh, Mario, I'd s he does benefit from heavy characters and uh, uh, just big characters as well. But he does have only one platform option. Normally, he likes multiple platforms. So we'll see how uh, how many uh, aerial or uh, up air setups he can get. I know when me and uh, when me and Matt were talking about stages, he seemed like he was very leaning towards stages like. The, like, um, Dreamland and Battlefield were like the ones he would really want. Yeah, the tri platform and uh, Dreamland has the added benefit of it's yeah. a little bit more open than Battlefield, at, le at least in terms of blast zones. So the Duck Hunt was another one he was really looking, like you looking at. Um, because Duck Hunt, the ducks can actually you, you, you can actually shield behind the ducks when um, when Blue oh, goes wow, to the Oh wow, yeah, yeah, buttons. true, true, true. And what happened? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I believe that was a back air sweet spot from Blue. Normally, that's Good how it goes Charizard. Blue. Props to Blue for taking that back here. Mass really ought to be aware of that in this matchup right here. Oh yeah, he should be definitely aware of that. And he is playing a little bit more reserved, throwing out those fireballs, trying to keep mm -hmm. him away. But he is trying to find for back air. Oh Scott, Matt has got to go for something quick before he gets in a very bad situation. Oh, and the spike Lost coming through it! Oh my gosh! Blue making a statement with that one! No He's... jumps out of options? Yeah. Go down to the town, people. Air dodge and pray. One-way ticket. But your prayers were not answered. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Matt's feeling the effects, but he's a good player. He will be able to bounce back. But he, I, everybody's got to be feeling that right now. Oh, when you see someone just looking down like that, scratching their beard, you can see Matt in the player cam. He's exactly. He's like, <sighs> yeah, usually I just throw myself back and close my eyes. That's my, my dead giveaway. Like, that should not have happened, and I'm angry and Scratching upset. Scratching his stubby facial hair. <laughs> <laughs> stubby? Come on. Give me a little bit more. I, had I, to, I trim this once a week. I was not I was <laughs> talking about you. Oh, okay. My bad. I thought, I thought you were directly calling me out for something. No, 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 no. Okay. No, no. no, no. <laughs> Any, I was afraid of that. Anyone who does not oh, shave. Oh, okay. Anyone who keeps their hair shaved is stubby. Okay. With little stubs. All right. All right. Um, Matt bouncing right back with the... A final destination counter pick. A little bit unorthodox compared to what we were uh, predicting. That is true, but I know that Blue, he loves to go to Battlefield, basically with Charizard and Mewtwo. So, I could see this as the reason why we're going here. Uh, so, um, but in terms of aerial game, Mario ha has some potential with open air as well. Especially with, yeah, he's really relying Can on we that. talk about these combos right here, Matt? <laughs> exactly. He's relying on that big body of Charizard. Matt is going in with only 8%. Has a 92% wow. lead on him right now. Keeping the Matt's pressure. Yeah, sorry. He's keeping the pressure on. Go ahead. Sorry. Uh, he's doing a really good job so far. Just pressuring. Not, he's not letting that spike get to him from game one. Absolutely, yeah. And it's always good to throw out those, uh, those up smashes as well. He's keeping the pressure on. He's looking for even more aerial games, but he was a little bit more fearful that time. Blue seems to be a little bit wise to how he shifted his gameplay this time around. Okay, didn't opt for the back throw. I, I thought that would have been best option there. And of course, using those iframes of that, uh, yeah. The, uh, skull, not Skull Bash, I don't think. Rock Smash. Rock Smash, that's it. Something Smash. And as the lead gets larger and larger for Matt right here, he's having to be more and more careful for the tricky options of blue. One more hit, and then I, I'm pretty sure that up throw will kill at this percent almost with all this rage built up. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Gotta be careful. Great down smash, uh, recognizing that he w was caught in the slide turnaround animation for Charizard. So uh, he's able to edge out the first stop on Blue. That down smash is just what Mario needed right there. But yeah, he's gonna get, uh, Blue's gonna get a lot more chances to use that flamethrower wall uh, that keeps out a lot of characters, especially with Mario, who usually recovers low because of his diagonal up B. All right, Matt not staying with the combos as much as he was earlier in the match, but he doesn't need it right now. Yeah, this high percent, he shouldn't be over committing too much. Yeah, he's playing a little bit more reserved, and he does have the stock lead, like you said, so he can do that. But 
potential edge guard option here. Again, throwing out the flamethrower, right. but. Mario's invincible up B is going to help him out mm -hmm. in a lot of favorable situations. Yeah, he is opting to go really low instead of just going for straight diagonal for that ledge. Yeah. Curious to see if we'll see Blue punish that later. Great. And Blue gets the up tilt. Yeah, great recognition. Uh, recognizing that Mario was just falling right into him, looking for probably a neutral attack setup. But again, these right, Mario's going Mario's so dangerous at these low percentages because he can he has complete control. Gets the cape, almost had to dunk! Oh my gosh! That's playing very well off stage right here. Mm. He's got to keep his options open, not overcommit too much, but just wait for Blue to mess up on some kind of opening. Yeah, right now Blue is playing a little bit more than neutral, throwing out attacks that are keeping Matt at bay, but Matt does have another aerial opportunity here, and he throws out the neutral to get back, but it leads right to a grab. All right, we've been seeing Matt, oh. thro <laughs> Matt throws out the forward smash. Just when in doubt. Rip. When in doubt. And Let's it rip. Yeah. Great, great turnaround from first round. I'm sorry about that. But, yeah, that was just such a nice statement saying that uh, that that spike from the first round wasn't going to get to him at all. Well put. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, scores 1-1 one, one right here. I'm so, oh, did I take what you were going to say? I'm, so, I'm so sorry. Oh, no, no. Okay, I, I didn't say, I didn't say anything. Okay. <laughs> How many viewers we got? Uh, right now we have six. Yes. Yeah, it's still a solid, even number six. Yeah, nice. <laughs> oh, because we got the host from that monkey emperor. Thank you very much for the uh, added two uh, two viewers. Thanks a lot for that, buddy. Thank you. And we do see the swap to Mewtwo for Blue here. Okay, and we yes, Battlefield is open for him. This is going to be uh, actually yeah, this is going to be really nice. It's a one-one situation, and both of these characters love this stage. So Blue's this pulling. this is going to be hype. Is Blue doing this? Uh, is he do is he doing this right now? I believe he is. Pulling out Mewtwo? Yeah. Haven't seen this in quite a little <laughs> while. Haven't seen this Mewtwo in quite a little bit now. Um. Oh yeah, that was somebody else that went Mewtwo. That's my fault. That was uh the uh. The hat dude. Okay. Alright, we're rotating commentators here. But in the meantime, Matt seems to be playing out neutral pretty well. Oh, it gets a nice forward smash read. Yes. Matt's playing out Battlefield very well with this counter pick. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back on the mic, at least for a bit. So. Alright, hey Trebby. Yo. All right, cool. All right, so it looks like I didn't miss too, too much. All right. Now, scores one, scores one, one right now. Nice. Uh, Blue winning game one, then Matt coming back with a great, with a pretty good comeback so far. Nice. Anyway, Blue loves Battlefield. This is Mewtwo counter picks. So. Yep. However, but Mario loves Battlefield in general. So. Yep. So, the overall, this counter pick is pretty even between the two oh. characters. And he get, oh, that's gonna be that was death. a great mash out by Matt. He almost actually got out of that, but Blue just uh, perhaps yeah. Blue recognizing the rush in and. Getting that disable up smash for the kill. All right, Matt taking the roll, taking out. A good decision from yep. him. Great forward air landing. Ooh, read the roll, All but right. just the wrong direction. Matt's been going for a lot of forwarders this game. He ended up last game with number one also, along with having a good read early on. I'm hoping it's not too stale by now. All right. I think he might have planned that he's not going to kill with that move. All right, this right now. Matt just has to play a little more patient. Go for the get up smash. Just try to pressure him out of some kind of option. Back air could work. Move is a lot of knockback growth. It'll kill pretty reliably. But... All right, nice, nice uh, use of side beat mix up. Oh, we have a Gets broken the shield. shield break. Gonna be Dead. certain death here. All right, <laughs> Matt, they're reflecting that right at him. Blue's gotta be a little more careful. May throw out the confusion or something. Hopes that does and hope that doesn't happen again. Ooh. Okay, Blue's gotta realize that that's not working right now. Matt is actively looking for the Shadow Ball when he has the full um, Shadow Ball, at least at a certain distance. And again, Matt gets a quick 33%, almost tying it up at this I point. I mean, a good 25 of that was like just oh, that the was, Shadow that was 30, Ball. That was 33 off the Shadow Ball. Yeah. Shadow really? Ball alone. Ah, Reflectors. Oh, oh, there we go. Nice. We, saw, we saw Blue adapting a little bit, throwing out Confusion, so he's going to... That sends a message exactly. to Matt saying, I'm And I don't no. think Matt, uh, Mario's um, cape can reflect a move that has been reflected a second time. I don't think it's strong enough it's to do tricky. that. It's tricky. Have you ever uh, played Mewtwo Ping Pong? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I mean, the thing is, it has a limit. All reflectors have a limit, so. Yeah, but it's not going to I have with Palutena, because her, her wall um, reflector will actually right. block it twice. So. Mario's reflector isn't going to start giving out until at least, like, the third Shadow Ball. All right. Great pivot grab there, but that's not going to kill yet. Not enough rage. Surprisingly. 
<laughs> Ooh, the forward air will do it though. That up throw kills surprisingly fast, and yeah. Blue clutches out game, the third game. So Blue will take the, win the winner's quarters victory. Matt giving Blue a run for his money, <laughs> but not quite enough. You bet. Fine showing by Matt, but you know, Blue is Blue. Goes to true man.